If you can't find a window panel that suits your needs, it's simple to create your own. First of all, create it out of basic elements like slabs, walls and columns. I'm just going to create mine out of a slab at the moment. And I'm just going to draw something that's one meter high, arrow down by two meters, push OK. So if I go to my 3D window, we can see I've just got a straight square block of wood. And if I select that again, go to the corner and click on this icon here. Now I want to drag a copy onto itself. So I'm just going to hold, once I've started moving it, push the control key down, a little plus sign comes up. And I'm going to drag it back onto itself. Then I'm going to select one of them. They're both the same, so it doesn't matter which one I select. Then I choose the offset all angles icon, move it in a little bit. And then I'm going to edit the inside panel, which is which I'm going to change the glass. So I'm going to change that. First of all, I'm going to make it 20 millimeters thick. And I'm going to make it minus 25. So it sits in the middle of the slab. I'm going to change it to glass and to a clear fill. Push OK. Now I'm going to select the outside slab and hold my space bar down and click on the inside slab. Now if I go to the 3D window, this is my window. Now when I'm saving this library part, I have to make sure that I'm looking at it from the right angle. So first of all, I click on the projection settings icon and we're going to look at it from a side view and I want to look at it from the top down because that's how it's going to sit in the plan. It's like I'll be on top of it looking down on it. So that's why we put the camera up there. So I push OK and I push F5 and there's my object. Now I'm just going to push Control A to select my object and then I'm going to go File, Libraries and Object, Save Custom Component. I'm just going to save this as a custom window panel. Push OK. When saving this, make sure you save it to the directory of a job or a central location where everyone can get a hold of it. If everyone can get a hold of it, if it's in a loaded library, it can easily be loaded into the custom panel option box. So I'm going to save it to this particular job, into the library modules folder, call it strange window, save. And now I'm going to remove the marquee. Now when I go to the window tool, it's already loaded and all I have to do is push OK. Now when I place the window, I go back to the 3D window, we can see there's my window and that's a custom panel and it works exactly the same way as every other ArchiCAD object does.